Good morning, Frank Watkins, 23rd of November 2021, with special comments from Joe. Uh, good morning, everybody. Okay, going to go straight into my scan. Uh, while that's happening, which will take all of half a second, just a couple of comments. Um, late November, December in front of us. A lot of people turn their back on the market during December, probably from 10th of Dec <coughs> through to, there's a special comment, <laughs> through to about 10th of January. And it always amuses me. I've seen some amazing moves uh, during that, let's say, Christmas break while everyone's got their back turned. So mm. um, just keep your eyes on it. Also, statistically, I don't think there has ever been a December, there might have been one or two somewhere, where the market closed at the end of deck lower than where it opened. Uh, for whatever reason, December seems to be a pretty good month. I think everyone's euphoric waiting for Father Christmas to <laughs> pop down the bloody window. No, 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 the chimney, that's right. Chimney. Okay. Um, high highs, higher low. Whoops. Um, we have six results, first one being FCL, and that doesn't look too bad. Um, basically, there's a lot of long-term support there at $3.50. Yeah. Had some good news here, burst forth, uh, retracement, and looking to get through about the 460 level. And just out of interest sake, um, I think if you're going to trade these high, high, high lows, the, uh, the pattern is far more applicable and appropriate in the better priced stocks. I don't think I'd spend too much time looking for high, high, high lows in the, um, the under 10, under, under 20 cent stocks. However, that's that's just a bit of an observation at the moment. Uh, HPR, nothing there for me. IDA, again, you know, a six and a half cent job. 400 million out there. Indiana Resources, uh, it is a long-term low. We've had a move up. I'd still like to see it retrace a bit. Um, on balance volume, rock solid since this big announcement and FOMO kicked in. So everyone that bought uh, into this on that announcement with FOMO is still in there. Um, if, if there was any selling, the OBV would have dipped at some stage, but um, rock solid OBV, yeah, um, only 400 million out there, so mm. tightly held. Mm. Resources stock, so the right sector, I guess. Yeah. Uh, now here's, um, okay, we haven't traded since the 1st of November, uh, but that's going to need a serious look at when it comes back on, whatever. It is whatever's happening. There's a lot of FOMO on that day. And uh, it'd be interesting to go and have a look at the news and see if that's a cap raise or just see what they're up to. But a lot of people caught stuck in that one. KFM, um, I wouldn't be raving about that as a high, high, high low, but break of 21 cents would be a, a decent break of some reasonable resistance. Only 34 million out there, so tightly held. And just out of interest sake, if we click on that little tab, just showing you another trick with this. Mining Exploration Company committed to increasing value for shareholders through the acquisition, exploration and development of so um, you can go into this uh, further and have a look at everything, but um, just fantastic to know that they're committed to increasing oh, value yeah. for shareholders. That's, yeah, that's, so, that is good to know, um, as opposed to saying that they weren't... Yeah, yeah. it's just about a buy signal on its own, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're a heathen. 
Um, and finally, WAC. Uh, interesting to see WAC has come up because uh, we, we actually whacked it back here mm. on this, this break yeah. and we're still in there. Um, OBV is fading a bit. Uh, the catch with these guys is they are a producer. A producer of Kalen in, uh, I think, Wickerpin in WA. So once you're a producer, out there on the bean counters and they say, well, okay, you've got X amount of ore with um, X price and X issued cap, therefore each share is worth Y. One of those old equations I learned at school where X plus X plus X equals Y. Okay, um, that is about it today. Um, so, touch wood, we'll talk to you tomorrow. See you tomorrow.